Hello everyone, thanks for tuning back in. This is Eric KJ4YZI. You're watching Ham Radio Concepts. And make sure to click that little notification bell over there somewhere because people say, I didn't know you made that video because they didn't have notifications turned on. So in this video series, we're gonna start with most all of the rig expert antenna analyzers that Gigaparts was kind enough to send me for loan to check out their entire line of rig expert antenna analyzers. Now, here's the thing. If you click on the link in any one of these videos below, Gigaparts is also giving my viewers a 5% code on anything on that page for any one of the rig expert antenna analyzers. So make sure you click on that and check it out. Antenna analyzers are very important and very useful for ham radio for checking your antenna before and after a certain event like weather or a change that you made to make sure that your antenna is operating correctly. And the rig expert line, although I've checked a couple of these out in the past, there's a lot of them. I think I have almost every one of them. And each one offers a little bit different frequency range or functionality. And I'm going to show you about each one of them quickly by rig expert. We're going to start today with the AA35 Zoom. Ham Radio Concepts is brought to you by HamRadioPrep.com. It's never been easier to learn about ham radio before you take the exam. And Ham Radio Prep makes it fun and guarantees your success. Visit HamRadioPrep.com. Use the code ERIC20 to instantly save 20% off every course you buy. Remember the name, HamRadioPrep.com. The thing about Rig Expert Antenna Analyzers is they have a two-year guarantee on all their products. They want to stand behind it, and they have a large user base online with uh, support groups and uh, firmware updates and contact information so that you make sure you are not left in the dark with their products. That's the good thing about this. Now, to show you the manual real quick, real quick Rig Expert does a great job in a color illustrated manual that shows you all kinds of parameters on what you can do with this thing. I mean, you could use this for just a rapid check out of an antenna, tuning it to resonance because, again, you don't want to mask a poor operating antenna with a tuner. You want to tune the antenna for optimal performance and having an antenna analyzer will make you most resonant and most accurate in your HF or VHF, UHF, depending on the model that you have for best performance, okay? And if you're those who make coaxial stubs or, or matching stubs and you need to know the capacitance and inductance of this, this device will tell you. So, a great manual. Now, in each one of these, I'm gonna show you real quick, not that I do unboxings anymore, but you gotta see what this comes with, okay? Um, they give you the case, they give you a USB cable, and the USB cable is because this analyzer can be connected to your computer via USB, and you can map and plot all the information on your device in the field to see the graphs of different bands and different characteristics as you make changes instead of just doing it on the screen. Record these and save the data for later use. They also always include batteries with this. This device, uh, open this cover here, okay? takes two AA batteries. Now some of them may take more, I'm not sure if all of them take two AA batteries, but they provide the batteries. And I would recommend using, um, although you can use nickel metal hydride rechargeables, the alkalines are probably the best performance. The soft carry case for out in the field with the strap that just fell over the table there. Okay, and uh, that's what it comes with. What can you do with this? I'm gonna connect outside through my window here. I have the m -Pass, Chameleon m -Pass 2.0. I have it connected, uh, I'm going to connect it here, the top is an SO239, you can get various adapters, some of the other modules or models may have a UHF on top and require an adapter or come with the adapter. But this AA35 Zoom can show you multiple bands at one time in real time or in a, a specific band by itself of the SWR and other characteristics. I'm going to show you that right now quickly on this AA35 Zoom. So the AA35 Zoom will cover from DC way down into like 50 or 100 kilohertz all the way up to 35 megahertz with the Zoom function that we're going to show you here in a second. Um, so if you need something for VHF, UHF, there's other models, check my playlist for those that will cover higher frequencies. So upon turning this on, you get a nice color display, okay, probably easy to read in most uh, light conditions. All right. Now we're going to show you three, without going every single bit of it, I'm going to show you three most common ways that you'll check SWR and use this to your advantage on the antenna. For instance, we're going to go first to an SWR meter. Now I have my Chameleon m 2.0 connected on top, and this thing is pretty good across almost all the HF bands, so I'm going to just use it as a demo to show you so I have something connected to it. 
Now this is the simplest way for one band, a rapid check of an SWR, okay? And you can change the frequency up top by hitting number three, and you can change the frequency. We're gonna go to um, 18.150, somewhere in 17, mega, uh, 17 meter band, and we're gonna hit start. And it shows you in real time, 1.6 to one, return loss 12.8 dB. And that is real time. So as you change stuff where the antenna is blowing around, you can see the meter move and the values change. But that's one way. You can hit OK to stop. Now we're going to go to another way, which would be a, a, a graph. OK, so watch this. If we go back and we go to the SWR chart. Now I could go into the, uh, the frequency range and I could first hold F and I could check by different bands, 10, 12. We'll go to 20 meters. Okay, it's set at the center frequency and it's gonna sweep uh, plus or minus 175 kilohertz. So that's the center of the band, it's gonna sweep the entire 20 meter band, okay? And we'll hit start. Now watch this. That's plotting the SWR across the entire 20 meter band. And if you wanted to use the zoom function, you can go up or down here and you could really zoom in to a specific frequency or um, for instance, if we go to frequency range and I type in center frequency would be, let's say 15 megahertz. And I wanna sweep 10 megahertz each way. And I can hit start. Now watch, it's gonna sweep all the way across. And I could use left or right and I could find a spot and I could zoom in to see the parameters right there on the screen. Okay, you get the idea. Very useful to plot a multiple uh, multi-band antenna. Now, if you want to check resistance and reactance, you can go here and you can check this, you know, with the zoom function enabled as well to see exactly the resonance uh, and, and the values coordinating with that, okay? There's other things on here as well, all parameters. So you can hit start and it will show you everything at one snapshot. It will show you the SWR, the reactance, the impedance, the return loss, the uh, capacitance, inductance, and more, all at one shot based on the frequency that you pick. In this setup, it does give you the ability to change language. So for those who want to use English or a lot of different languages on here, like whatever, Chinese and French and maybe Russian, um, and you can choose the palette, the color, for those who may be a little bit colorblind or maybe visually impaired to certain frequencies of light, you can change it to where uh, it's a contrast color. Uh, it depends on your, your user uh, needs, okay? The battery settings for optimal, the sound, you can change the system impedance from 50 to 75 ohm or 100 ohm, depending on what you need to test. And also the units, uh, metric or imperial, right? And um, the bands for Europe and Africa or the Americas. Okay, so you can set that for certain predefined band uh, edges or limits. Cable vector factor and stuff. Bluetooth enabled. So it gives you a lot of interesting um, information on this AA35 Zoom. And there's more that are on bigger and better features on bigger and better units that I have that I'm going to show you. But in the meantime, this unit right here being cheaper than an MFJ269C with this much power, including com uh, computer connectivity, and um, you know, rapid checking of an antenna on a nice color display seems like a really good deal. And Gigaparts is giving you a better deal. If you look on the website, now link below, look at the top, you'll see the code for any one of their Rig Expert products, a discount code 5% just because you watched this video. So thank you everybody for watching. This is the beginning of the series, the AA35 Zoom by Rig Expert. More videos are on the way. Stay tuned, 7-3. This is KJ4YZI.